Yo guys and welcome back to the channel and at last we have some fighting game news to report on. Yes, the Japan Fighting Game Publishers Roundtable event happened this week. Oof, try and say that fast. And yes, we have a few new videos on some of the games what I'm mainly interested in cover on this channel. Uh, main one being Guilty Gear Strive. We played the beta back in uh, the start of lockdown. Love the game, really been looking forward to seeing what's happening next. Uh, it's obviously been delayed, put back to 2021 now, uh, but we have got some new character reveals, uh, which we're going to take a look at today. Uh, second thing, we had a few things from uh, Bandai Namco for Soul Calibur and Tekken, which we're also going to do videos on, and they'll be coming in the next couple of days. But for now, let's check out the Guilty Gear Strive trailers. The characters here, I believe. Changed a little bit with the title bit there, while the uh, little uh, icon spins around. Here we go. Seen a few bits on this dude. See? Is that a new stage? No, not Chip. <laughs> Oof. Cool. Nine seconds. This is the guy I'm most looking forward to seeing. Nagaryuki. I think that's how you say it. Uh, uh. Some mean attacks then. Wow. Almost like a cyborg ninja. Interesting. PlayStation 4 and PS5. Um, I would imagine it's just going to be the same copy used on both systems. I can't uh, see there being any difference whatsoever between uh, the two two different versions. Cool. Very, very good. The... Have we got any more here at the end? No. This dude, to me, looks like he's almost like a Sam Show character. I'm going to take a look more at him uh, more than the other, more than Leo. I'm more interested in this guy. Um, Chip was a big surprise for me in the beat. I really enjoyed playing him. The other guy what really interests me when I'm looking is this dude. Uh... Looks very much Sam Showish, very much like a Sam Show character with these big striking sword attacks. He looks fast as well with his dash. Very fast character. Got some meaty attacks. That's interesting. Let's run. So Arc System Works not disappointing with Guilty Gear. Really interested in the two characters uh, the release. Second one being more so, as I said, uh, during the actual trailer. It, I find it interesting. Uh, I think it even looks a little bit sharper. Uh, an animation a little bit uh, more on point than what it did in the beta. Might just be me and it's been that long since I played it or seen anything on Guilty Gear. Uh... But it blows me away every time I see this game. I think the I think the art style, I think the animation, incredible. The the camera work, what they do on the supers. I know a lot of people sort of um, on their web page. The thing what I do like, uh, which will back this up, is how they answer the questions from what we actually got to say about the beta. They give you obviously the feedback list, 
after the beta and uh, there were a few things in there what i put what i weren't quite happy with obviously the lobby system absolutely sucked ass the uh, matchmaking not great uh, netco needed a lot of work however they did say that obviously they were working on rollback which uh, i'll be interested to see if they do release another uh, demo before the game actually comes out see how well that plays which would be great but it seems like they are answering the questions and they are working with the feedback which shows that they care a hell of a lot about the game and the community what comes with the game uh, as i says we've got the capcom a uh, little event what they're doing i think that's around either the fifth or the eighth of this month which is next week uh, that's going to be showcasing all the new things for street fighter 5 and the continued support they're showing that with their uh, new dlc characters uh outfits and obviously a few different stages as well so that'll be interesting to see what sort of characters we might be getting there as well um with another little add on everyone thought street fighter 5 was done with champion edition obviously not so you know what to do guys for all things more on Guilty Gear and all the upcoming games. We've got the Tekken 7, we've got the Soul Calibur and of course the Capcom event next week which I'm going to be covering and doing videos on. Hit the subscribe, hit the notification bell so you get notified when all those videos go live. And once again guys, peace out, take care and I'll see you in the next video.